Today I'm making some turns at the venerable Catamount Ski Area in the Berkshires, right on the New York Mass border. Catamount has a number of classic New England trails, several of them mile-long cruisers. They've got eight beginner runs in the Meadows area and the Double Black Diamond Catapult Trail. Everything's open here at Catamount thanks to aggressive early season snowmaking and more than seven feet of natural snow this season. If you've been thinking about a mid-season tune-up for your equipment, now's a good time to do it. This week's mild weather changed the surface snow, but trail counts have not been affected at Holiday Valley, Peak and Peak, or Swain. Bristol Mountain will hold its monthly Full Moon Nordic Tour this Friday night. They're looking good, as is Greek Peak. The coverage is excellent at Song Mountain, Labrador, and Snow Ridge, where a big air contest is set for this Sunday. The runs are buried tree line to tree line in Macaulay Mountain, Woods Valley, and Royal Mountain. How about cruising on machine pampered snow this weekend at Gore, Whiteface, or Wyndham in the Catskills, where it's 80s weekend along with a big airbag throwdown set for Saturday. Killington, Stowe, and Smuggler's Notch in Vermont each picked up several inches of snow Monday night when the cold air returned. Out west, a jet stream pattern change will bring fresh snow in the coming days to Sun Valley, Jackson Hole, and Telluride. Now, if you're headed for Snowbird, Alta, or Park City, your timing's great because the flakes have really started to fly again in Utah. After a mild week, colder temperatures will return to the east this weekend. I'm Herb Stevens, a skiing weatherman.